Hey, what's up? I'm Patrick Cloud. And I'm Ayana. And we are still on the hunt for the best food truck in Los Angeles, yes. okay? So we already went to Taco Zone, mm -hmm. uh, but today's my turn, all right? And I'm gonna be taking you to Leo's taco truck, okay? Everybody says that this is the best tacos that you can get in Los Angeles. It's a little debatable because he gave my truck last week a 10, so we'll see. The Molitas did get a 10, but these are the best tacos, all right? Leo is a legend out here. Now, I just want to, it is at a gas station. We will, be, <laughs> we will be going to a gas station, but like I said, food trucks are more fire if they're in a dingy, low-key suspect spot. That's true. I agree. <laughs> okay, so you're gonna hunt for something vegetarian, and uh, I'm gonna get my usual. We're gonna go over to Leo's Tacos over there on Venice and La Brea. Let's go. All right, so we just got to Leo's Taco Truck. I'm about to show her the best taco spot in LA. You believe me? We'll see. Okay, okay, well, let's go then. <laughs> so you don't eat meat, so you're not gonna get the best of this. That's just the truth. Really? You just can't. Like, I'm getting El Pastor, I'm gonna get carne asada and a pollo, and a pollo uh, taco. So are you already setting the bar low because you know that this is not gonna be as good as my You're not gonna get anything good vegetarian here, but I, <laughs> I want you to watch me enjoy this place. <laughs> Hello, how you doing? All right, we just got back from Leo's. We got a lot of stuff. I think they probably <laughs> thought I was pregnant. The <laughs> amount of food that I ordered. <laughs> For sure. All right, so we got uh, two tacos, a veggie burrito, mm -hmm. And four malitas. Okay. So this is your veg burrito. Yeah. We got a bunch of sauces as we do. Oh wait, these must be the malitas. Oh yeah. I'm kind of excited. I'm not gonna lie. I'm ex I'm incredibly excited. Why wouldn't you be excited? Uh, so let's go ahead and dig in. Which one do you want to try first? Uh, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna. Unbox. Yeah, You're like a try. big kid right now. <laughs> right. <laughs> this is my okay. Okay, these are the malitas. All right, everything is unboxed and unwrapped, and uh, I'm wet. Can I say that? <laughs> Am I allowed to say that? Wait. You know what? Presentation compared to last week. Okay. I'm gonna have to give it to you. Okay. You notice that the tortillas look a little different. They than look tacos. homemade. Like the tortillas look homemade. I don't think I've ever had a homemade tortilla from a taco truck before. Okay. Looks like I'm off to a good start. So yes. I'm gonna go ahead and start with this El Pastor taco. Okay. Just because I can't not, I can't look at this for too long. <laughs> okay, I'll just be going into the El Pastor. I don't need no fixings. I've never had El Pastor before in my life. Uh, see, see the, the... Am I missing out? You gotta, you just gotta eat meat in this life, you know? <laughs> I don't, mm. Yeah, you just gotta eat meat in this life. This is a veggie burrito that I'm mm. eating. How is and it? it's really good. So what's in it, you think? I feel like it's mm. rice, beans, onion, cilantro, cheese, avocado. Pretty much like the melita I had last week, but burrito. And it's good. I like it. I didn't even hear most of that. My my hearing just went out. <laughs> Is it that good? Really? I think you're biased. I haven't had El Pastor in a long time. You love this place. I this mean, they hit every time. Real, I mean, the presentation, I have to give it up. How late are they open? 3 a.m. Very clutch. Okay. Very clutch. Unless they went corporate on us and closed up early. <laughs> when, I, when I was going heavy, it was 3 a.m. And I was out there. You know what's interesting? Mm. They have a high rating. And they're down the street from Lucy's Tacos. Like that famous place. Lucy's Tacos was on... I love Lucy's. Baby Boy. Remember when what? Tyrese was in the drive-thru mm -hmm. and his baby mama found condoms? the condoms in the back seat. Wow, that was Lucy's. That was Lucy's. But this is a little better than Lucy's to me. 
Yeah. Oh my god. This is good. Those tacos didn't stand H hands. Yeah. I can't believe we're done already. Is this we want to get in on these liters. Did they put tofu in there? Or is that cheese? What is that? Or maybe that's tofu. That's never a good thing to ask in a burrito. <laughs> what is that? Is it like tofu cheese or is that mm -hmm. cheese? It's like tofu. I don't think they use that type I've of cheese. I've never had tofu in, in your burrito. life. Oh, and a and tofu burrito. Boom. Tofu that's, burrito. They put tofu in this too. I missed that ingredient, guys. Sorry, I didn't know. All right, so the melita, cheese, and steak. This is crazy. This is a homemade tortilla, guys. I've never had this at a taco truck. Like this is crazy. And this Ooh. is avocado, beans, rice, and lettuce. Let's see if this. It's better than tacos, though. Cheers. Cheers. Melita, cheers. Melitas. Do you taste the difference in the homemade tortilla? I do. Right? It's softer, but off top, I like how they cook the other ones more. I like, like it, too. Like the burn marks and stuff. Mm hmm I wish they would have cooked this longer. Like, you got to burn the outside of a melita. Mm -hmm. Almost like a pancake. You mm -hmm. have you sear it in butter. Like, you gotta do it like that. I do like the consistency of the homemade uh, tortilla, though. It tastes a little sweet. All right, so just to give it a fair chance, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it with the sauce. Okay. Because Taco Zone had the sauce on deck. <laughs> and Taco Zone had the dip. Dip. Mmm. The dip helped. It helped, but it I have help. to say, I think I like my burrito better. The burrito is it for you? Mm-hmm. Burrito over Melita? The burrito is definitely better. Mm. This hits a lot harder with this sauce, though. Mm-hmm. Not even gonna lie. All right, so you tried the Melita. Mm hmm You tried the burrito. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Overall uh, rating, what do you judge, Leo? Okay, so as far as like presentation, like how the, all of the food looks, mm -hmm. I'd be very proud to like bring this to like a friend or family, boyfriend. Like, okay. I would be happy to be like, you're hungry, here's food <laughs> that I okay. bought for you. Um, and when it comes to taste, I would give the burrito a seven. Okay. But I'm going to have to give the Melitas like a six. Ooh. The reason I said six for the Melitas is because even though it's a homemade tortilla, I don't feel like they cook the outside as crispy as I like. I like it to be a little crispy. Mm -hmm. I don't mind that it's a homemade tortilla. I love homemade. But they could have put like a little bit more butter put on the outside. Put it in a little bit more. Mm -hmm, and made it a little crispier. I got to agree with that. So what's your overall Leo's Tacos rating? I think I'm going to give the place a seven. Okay. I'm going to give it a seven. <clears throat> That's a solid seven. <clears throat> What's my favorite right. number? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seven out of ten. That's not bad. <laughs> to see. I love Leo's. I have an attachment to it because of my college days. <laughs> um, tacos have always been on point. Tacos, ten out of ten. Can't, okay. can't, can't hate. Okay. Presentation, like you said, has always been on point. Melita's not as good as yours. If I, if, if I was introduced to Melita's through this, I'd be like, okay, they're good. The fact that I had them through Taco Zone... Those got a 10 out of 10. I would give the Melitas maybe a 7 out of 10. Okay. So my overall, Leo's, 8. Okay. That's fair. Leo's has amazing tacos. Maybe their vegetarian options need a little bit of work. And the Melitas could, could use a little browning. Mm -hmm. uh, but overall, I mean, I'm very happy with this meal. I'm Jesus, happy too. I'm, I'm about to knock this back. <laughs> <laughs> but thank you guys so much for watching yet another episode of Truck Chasers. Uh, I've been Patrick Powell. I am Ayana. And uh, let us know what other food trucks you know about in Los Angeles that we can pull up on. 